first thing you need to know about Tintin is that Spielberg has put his adventure cap back on. And we're not talking Kingdom of the Crystal Skull, we're talking Indiana Jones and the Last Crusade with this exquisite production. Maintaining the delightful spirit of Hergé's beloved novels, this is rip-roaring entertainment from the first frame to the last. Edgar Wright, Joe Cornish and Stephen Moffat have crafted a script that is as exciting and unpredictable as any true Tintin fan could want. Jamie Bell embodies Tintin impeccably. The cast, including Daniel Craig, Nick Frost and Simon Pegg, charm and light up the screen. But Andy Serkis steals the show as Captain Haddock. The chance purchase of a model ship sets Tintin and his faithful dog Snowy on a roller coaster journey, evading assassination attempts and kidnappings to uncover the secrets of the unicorn. The animation is by far the finest yet seen on the big screen, and Spielberg pulls it together, proving why he has earned the reputation as cinema's finest filmmaker. Did you hit anything? Oh dear. One of the best things about Spielberg's Tintin is that it will appeal to grown-ups and kids alike. I came out of the screening just one hour ago and I'm still buzzing. I honestly have not felt so excited after leaving a cinema since I first saw E.T. in 1983. Enjoy. How could you let them escape? If Sakharin finds the ship before we do, it's over. This isn't just the ship. Yours, vengeance. Oh, you looked a little cold, so I lit a wee fire in a boat. Well, this is a fine mess. 